Hi everyone. This time I'm going to show you an application that allow you to update your database and that also allow you to create a table in that database. The database may be present locally on your machine or that may be hosted somewhere on one of your web servers or that may be hosted on a third party web server. So for example, uh, you have seen uh, on cPanel uh, where if you look at here on my screen so it appears like this and uh, where you can access your tables using php my admin so let's take an example of this particular case and uh, here i can see only one table right now and uh, here if you look at the interface uh, you will see the database name on the top it says uh, math price underscore test and below that uh, there are a lot of options that uh, uh, allow you to perform various operations uh, for tables and uh, the data if I go back to our tool and uh, let's say I ask it to create an employee table and uh, I have the data in one of my sheets uh, for this uh, for this demo I inserted few dummy records and uh, our main sheet so uh, let's put the table name here on uh, this uh, text box where uh, it says put table name and then click on this create button in the back end it makes a connection with the, the server and within few seconds you will see a message that says uh, table is created successfully so once the uh, table is created it will then start inserting the data uh, so for this case it will be inserting only uh, a number of records that we put in the main sheet so initially when uh, you just uh, create the table uh, it will uh, show you like this and uh, uh, it won't show you any records here it will just show you the table structure but uh, as you go on uh, it will show you it will start showing you the results so as i keep on refreshing i'll be getting more and more results so there were only 13 uh, records there in the sheet so now i have uh, the complete data uploaded and it is showing me the message uh, that data is uploaded successfully and uh, similarly if i go back to my database so here uh, here if i go back to uh, the second table which i uploaded uh, so for here uh, i uploaded around 3400 records and all these were uploaded uh, in a minute or below so the results or the outcomes uh, uh, you will see very quick because uh, the tool directly uploads uh, without any other uh, third party in intervention. This was all about uh, create new uh, functionality and we have uh, another feature here uh, which is uh, update data. So update data uh, won't create a new table rather it will uh, update the previous table or the existing table. It uh, truncates data uh, uh, the whole data from the current table and then uh, upload a fresh copy of it. So if you quickly have a look here now uh, employee table is having uh, 13 records you can see the row count here and uh, even if I go inside you can see the row count here and I'm coming back and I'm going to the tool now um, uh, I actually want to update uh, the table uh, employee so what I'm doing here is let's say I delete a couple of records and let's say I make some changes here I say this is uh, uh, John okay so this is just a minor change and it should reflect here when I use update data so it won't be creating a fresh table and if I open the browser and I refresh the database now it says five records as it says that data is uploaded and if I go inside you will see that the new changes are reflecting here so this is pretty much and uh, if you further want to know or if you want to have a quick demo or, uh, or over TeamViewer or Skype, you can uh, write to me at excel.microk at gmail.com or you can also visit my website extremexelsolutions.weebly.com. Goodbye.